key addition to the game version of From Russia With Love are the two new Bond girls. The first is played by British recording star Natasha Bedingfield, fresh off her 2004 platinum debut album Unwritten, which included two number one singles. The character that I'm playing is Elizabeth Stark. She's the Prime Minister's daughter. She's just in a party, socialising, and then she gets kidnapped. And of course I need someone to save me, so Bond jumps to the rescue. It's great because I get to do all these really funny sound effects where I'm like, Help, help, save me! Put me down, you stupid man! My daddy's a very powerful man, you know, you can't just go around Shut doing up! I kind of acted it up a bit and really played on the English accent because the Prime Minister's daughter must, of course, have a very English accent. She's got to be proper. She's a lady. <laughs> Young lady. <laughs> I think what appealed to me about being involved in the game was just, it was the whole Bond thing. James Bond is just sexy, especially the Sean Connery original. I don't know what it is, but I just know that every man since watching that just wants to be like that and every woman wants a man like that. The second Bond girl is played by actress Maria Menounos. She's done everything from One Tree Hill to the new Fantastic Four movie and has just been announced as a special correspondent for Access Hollywood and The Today Show. This is my first video game and I was a little nervous, but when I heard about the Bond video game, I was like, of course, of course I'll be a part of it. And then Sean Connery, I mean, all these things just started jumping out at me. Sean Connery, be a Bond girl and play this cool, crazy, intense character. Yeah, I think I'll do it. My character's name is Eva. I play Red Grant's assistant or henchwoman, so I'm basically on his team to take down Bond. Playing evil's fun. That was like the best part is to get really angry and really, all units, we have to stop Bond. I already think I'm tough and I already know I'm tough, so I didn't need the costume, but it definitely helps. The whole process of all the dots on the face and the animation, and it's a whole different world than playing yourself, physically yourself. We did a lot of um, facial recognition. We just kind of moved the face around and smiled big and frowned and did things like that so that they had that to work with. I had to pretend I was getting beat up by Bond, so it was like, oh! It's very exciting to be a Bond girl. It's something that's become so big, such a coup. Like if you, you know, if you get to be the next Bond girl, it's like, oh my goodness. I mean, a few people that I've told already that I was going to be a part of this video game and be a Bond girl, and that Sean Connery would be doing the voice, they were just blown away.